Hey guys, Deathmog91 here. So, I'm back for another part. So, okay, so let's find out what's in this chest. A monster in the box. Great. Okay, it's just a Lobo. No big deal. 13 damage, that's not... Ow. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and... <laughs> yeah, should have talked to him first. So yeah. Like, just read. Dragoon boots are fun. Just to mess around with. Yay, got a little tunic. Okay, so he's just going over the save point again. Then, any time within like first half of the game, uh, you can come back here if you need any reference. Yeah, guys. Sorry about the last vi uh Sorry about the last video being uh so long. But I mean, I'm. I don't know. You lose track of time when you're playing, so. Okay. Collective. Safe. Shield. Gotta love haste. Slow. Hate that. That's really bad, too. I'd rather have slow over stop. Okay, that's always useful to know. Just how to run. Okay. Sleeping bag. That's actually going to come pretty handy a, a little bit in the game. So, I will be doing a lot of training just because... It's a bit better. Yeah, Life 3. This is the only game I think that actually uses it for Final Fantasy wise. But I could be wrong there. I mean, I've played through almost all of the Final Fantasies. But I don't remember off the top of my head. <laughs> they forgot this. They didn't spell reflect right. That's funny. But yeah. It's just kind of good to talk to everybody in here and then check. Yeah, reflect it can be pretty nasty. Okay, tonic. Yeah, for the most part, your armor won't change till you get to the next city. So we have to make it quite. In reality, this is quite a long distance, but video game reality, no, this is not. You gotta figure each step I'm taking is a mile. At least. Uh, 
Okay. You're more likely to... Actually, I don't know what the... I don't remember the stats on all this stuff. Honestly, I've got to find my old... I actually have a, uh, a strategy guide for Final Fantasy 5 and 6, which is old. But whatever, I can check to see the stats if you guys are interested. Okay, yay. For the most part, this episode, I'm not going to continue. I'm just going to go ahead and battle because... I kind of need to get my stats up. Even though there's not... Well, there are going to be some harder enemies coming up. I mean, these guys, for instance, I... They're like three or four hits a kill. And they're doing 12 damage to Terra every hit. I recommend you don't use magic the first time uh, with Locke in your group until you get Edgar and it's kind of funny. Oh uh, yeah, there's the boss battle actually coming up. About probably I'll try to get one boss battle in every uh, episode, but depending on how fast or how long an episode is I mean it's gonna be roughly 20 to 40 minutes an episode from here on in unless things go really bad but that probably won't happen so yeah you mainly just want to attack kill these enemies like at the beginning of the game I mean look Locke's already at three at uh, seven level seven with Terra only at five but she'll gain a level next one next battle guaranteed but ideally you would before you get your, before we go into the castle right there uh, we're gonna want to get up to like level 10 to make it easier on us so that's the one thing with Final Fantasy if you've never played it before or even watched any of the videos of Final Fantasy gameplays there's a lot of time where you're just gonna have to train so yeah this is just a side project I've got a lot of side projects I'm doing just for the fun of it Yep. Uh, when they get really low, where they've got maybe about a fifth of health left, and there is a 1 in 20 chance. Actually, it's a lot. Ooh, antidote. Cool. There's less than a 1 in 20 chance that you can go through and use their. It's called a limit break, but it's not really. Their special attack. A lot of people just refer to it as limit break because, uh, in one sense, it is a limit break. There's not too many. You don't see it too often in the video game, I'll tell you that. Out of all the times I've played through it, I've seen, I think I've seen every character's uh, limit break, is what we'll go with it, its name, maybe one to two times if that but yeah it's better off trying to get it later in the game when yes the enemies are tougher but you don't have to worry so much about everything only reason why I'm coming back here instead of using the sleeping bag which I have four of. Well, I didn't think I had that many. Sleeping bag only recovers one person. Tent recovers everybody. So, I could use the sleeping bag twice, but I'd rather get their stats increased. I mean, yeah, look. It's gonna take a while.
that there's a lot to this game that it's actually a pretty fast paced game for first half you can beat it the first half of the game I think level like 25 30 you'd be okay but I'd rather be safe than sorry like at least level 10 on these guys and then later in the game depending on your levels uh, usually the characters that you get you'd get aren't actually set level wise I found Cause this is from playing multiple times different scenarios and whatnot you can usually get your character the higher your level is the higher your, the character that you're gonna get level is then guaranteed right now I know for a fact I am gonna go through there's one part I have to replay at least once and I know I'm at the beginning of the game and I already know this well the likeliness is I will have to replay it once I'll explain that when I get that when I get there which isn't gonna be for quite some time I mean yeah if you play the game and you can figure it out leave a comment I want to see who can figure out what part I'm talking about that you are gonna want to replay it at least more than one time because there are a lot of different parts that you have to and I what I mean by replay I mean like you actually you can die from it not you messed up where you have to redo the whole thing again so that knocks out the play I'm sorry guys I'm not trying to spoil anything but I mean come on this game is 16 to 17 years old already and I mean it's like okay whatever Yeah, so probably worth going and healing again in a few battles. If you stay in the grass, you're not gonna gain as much experience as you would if you're in the sand. Just because the enemies in the sand are actually stronger. You can actually watch from uh Nashir, or whatever it is. I don't know how I pronounced the name right. Uh, to uh, Figaro Castle. You can make it without in facing a single enemy, but the odds are you will face somebody. Which, I mean, if you want to train, that's your call. I. I'm just gonna train just because it's I'm better off training than I am uh, not training cool lock in the level plus right now it's a good time to get as much GP aka Gale aka money just because money it's not that it can be hard to come by but it can be very annoying and there are some good items you're gonna want to buy in the next in uh, Figaro Castle Leafers, for the most part, they'll die in one hit. But yeah, you see how lock was down right there? That's how you have to be to get the limit break. But I'm not gonna. I don't think I'll get it. If I can come across. If. 
I do it right, I will go through and do just like a montage video of everybody's limit break, but that's gonna take a while. I mean, this is barely in the game. I'm hoping that this will kind of get some good views off you for YouTube, but I don't care. I want to play through this game series anyways, just because it's a fun game. Like I said, I mean, yeah. <laughs> yeah, with me working quite often, I mean, I've already done 15 minutes. I might, I'll go save in a few minutes and then, then call this the end of the episode, I guess. Uh, but yeah, with me working all, all the time. I'm gonna go ahead um, I'm gonna try to put up videos but I'm working five six days a week on average I I'm probably not gonna get back into Yu-Gi-Oh I mean I'm still gonna play it but I'm not gonna waste my money on it except for when my friends bring it back for me from Germany he's gonna bring me back a at least one or two German boxes, which is gonna own. I mean, it's hard to it's hard to get German cards down here. Sweet. They can do double tax sometimes, so you can. This is uh this one game you can hold four characters on average, which is actually the average. Okay, so Ox still got about four. Okay, so they're both gaining level about the same time. I'm gonna go ahead and say, I'll go up one more level. Then, eh, one or two more. I haven't. That I'm going to figure out castle. But just because right now, I need to have them gain a little more experience by my preference. Just because things can get very annoying. Is the word I'm looking for. Plus, this is actually one of the fat games where you. If you just spend like half an hour battling, for the most part, you can get your GP, your money up quite quickly. As long as you're not fighting the stupid leafers. I mean, leafers, they give you 12 experience. Sometimes you get a tonic, not other times. And you get 45 GP. That's not that good. I mean, yes, I know for a fact. You'd gain more experience by just going through and saying, okay, go it alone, but then if you die, you die. Which no one likes. Bye bye, Leafer. Tell you the truth, I would love to see Squaresoft slash Enix. Yes, the two different companies, but originally they were the same company. They had a they split because they were doing like two big projects, and they needed just two different teams or something like that. I don't know exactly. They just needed help to do another thing. But yeah. <laughs> I would love to go through in a few weeks or whenever I can whenever I take the time to figure it all out. I wanna go through and do a live stream of me on the dueling network 
anybody can challenge me and see how that goes I don't think anybody's really done something like that I'll be doing a few hours guaranteed I'll see if I can well if I figure it out I might be able to see if I can get some other Yugi tubers to do it but I wouldn't um, actually I, I probably won't I'll see how that goes first and you know I mean the matches have been going pretty well for the most part but yeah if you take a look at the d down in the corner okay when I'm not in the middle of a battle I'll explain that in a minute Okay, come on guys. Kill him already. Our arenas are basically scorpions. I mean, come on. Don't they look like scorpions? Yeah. Okay, so in the co uh, the right bottom hand corner, there's the little map. The little map, okay, the red dot, that's you. The white dots are where towns are. And right now, there's th three islands in total. But yeah, for the most part, you're not going to worry about uh, the island other two islands for a while just because you're not gonna go through and get to them anytime soon but yeah that's just kinda how it is stupid leafer okay 38 experience let me see where I'm at stats Okay, 171 and 222. Okay. Wow. I don't know why I did that. I just did that. 